Double I Double AG Boys High School Volleyball, the undefeated Teason High Titans. Emengilao facing off against the Friars at the Phoenix Center. Nerves getting to both teams in this big matchup, forcing a couple of early serving errors. FD led 9-4 when the Titans made a run to take the lead 12-10. The home team went up 20-14 and closed out the set off a serving error by Teason for the 25-18 first set win. The Friars jumped out to a 16-9 lead in the second set before Teason made a late run to cut into that lead down 19-18. FD never trailed in the set and went on a 6-1 run to end the game behind a DeAndre Cruz block and Aiden McDonald kill. The father doing his Friars handed the Teason High Titans their first loss of the season in two straight sets, 25-18, 25-19. 48 bowlers are competing in the 2018 Guam High School's Bowling League after an unsuccessful attempt at trying to get the sport into the IIAAG. Joey Miranda and the Guam Bowling Congress assisted in putting together this event. Bowlers are taken to the lanes in singles, doubles, and team system competitions. Games are held at Central Lanes in Tamuni for the next three Saturdays, followed by the All-Island Tournament. Results from this past weekend Boys Division, Ukudu A got the win over Ukudu B, 14-0. FD D team got the win over the C team, 10-3. JFK blanked out FD B, 12-0. And FD tied with T's and High, 7-7. On the girls' side, Ukudu B slipped past Notre Dame, 8-6. And Ukudu A got the win over T's in, 11-3. FSAC basketball over at the Estumbo Gym, Team Guam. Taking on John B. Smart in the juniors division, J.P. Cruz with two of his game-high 15 points off the layup for John B. Smart. Team Guam hanging around, keeping the score close. A.J. Carlos with the pass to Billy Belger, who finds Alshay Grape open in the corner. Grape hits the three-pointer. He finished the game with 11 points. Off the inbound, John B. Smart looking to get the ball inside the paint. Curtis Silva misses on the shot baseline. Sevi Sisuiko gets the putback to go. John B. Smart edged out Team Guam 64-63. Two missed free throws down the stretch hurt Team Guam. Jeff Serrano put up 12 in the win for John B. Smart. Jonathan Kanamoto put up 8 in his team's losing effort. Team DNA Dizzy was crowned champions of the Triple J Volley for a Cause tournament after two days of friendly competition. 16 teams came out in support to help raise funds for the annual Relay for Life. Team Bank of Guam Yankees took second place after a hard-fought battle. Triple J Enterprises, Inc. joined thousands in the community in raising funds to support the American Cancer Society's efforts in cancer research, screenings, supporting patient services, and educational programs that give our local cancer patients the gift of time. The annual Relay for Life event will be held on Friday, May 25th from 6 to 12 a.m. at the George Washington High School track and field in Mangilao.